Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So VLD stock started moving higher and uh, obviously this is for the shorter time frame. So you can expect some trading bounce back if it continues to move higher. But before talking anything about upside, it is also very much important for VLD stock to keep on trading and sustaining above two most important levels, which in this case are 0.28 which is now your support and we have 0.27 as far as the stop loss is concerned. So number one, please do not go below these two specific levels as far as the lower end of the range is concerned. Oh, because below 0.27 or less, the downside will start again. And only if the stock continues to trade and sustain above 0.28 or more, which it is as of now, then we can expect some trading bounce back moving forward so what lies ahead is the question so going forward if vld stock continues to trade and sustain above 0.28 the immediate target we have in front of us is 0.33 then we have 0.37 and we can expect this particular stock to swing up to 0.48 on the upside so these are all the moves which will eventually become active once the stock started trading and sustaining above 0.34 right now what is active is 0.27 and 0.28 on the downside and 0.33 on the upside only after 0.33 or 0.34 or more this will be the extended price action that will become active as i told you i'm telling you again this will be a trading bounce back so you cannot expect the price to contain uh, you know continue to move higher and then to sustain so if you are thinking about easy entry easy exit this may not be a situation when we are looking or dealing into a trend which is very short term in nature so this is the end of the video thanks for watching